Hi Leung, how are you? Yeah, I'm good. Great. I have a very important announcement to make. Really? Yes. As you are my best friend, you are the first person outside my family I'm announcing this to. Wow. <laughs> I'm getting married! And the wedding is next month! What's the matter? You're not happy for me. I know. You can't share my wedding night, but that's not the issue, right? No, not really. I'm happy for you. It's just that you got to wear three wedding ring for now. One is engagement ring, wedding ring, and suffering. La 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 Uncle Fong! You hey. know what? John, I'm very happy! I'm the happiest guy in Singapore today! Why? Your reason better be good. You just distracted me reading this story about an 85-year-old Chico Pei raping an 80-year-old virgin. Whoa! My reason is excellent, Uncle Fong. I just met a tall, beautiful lady with a low, sweet voice. Next week, we're gonna dance. Hey, did you say tall and low voice? Yeah. And hey, my nephew, you better be careful, you know. She can be an aqua or transvestite. Really? Because tall and low voice are trademarks of a typical aqua. Why are you such a cute joy and suspicious? No wonder you're not married. Hey, my nephew, I'm just concerned for you. Because you have the habit of making wrong choices. For example, the last time, you dated this 40-year-old divorcee just because you were interested in the doctor. Uncle Fong, you have no right to advise me when you use service. Is what? It's an aqua. Rubbish! Who told you that? I saw your photo drop onto the floor from your wallet. Oh! I'm really in love with Siva. She's better than any Chinese girl I know. She's a great friend and lover and I know she will become a great wife and mother. But the thing is, my stupid parents are a real pain. The Chinese are racist. They want me to break up with Siva and get to know a hawker's daughter who will win a prize for sing dish if there's a competition. But I will not let my thoughts come in the way of my happiness. If I have made up my mind. If they are too capable, I will allow the Siva and I will meet them again. What do you think? To tell you the truth, I was in such a situation before. Only then, the girl was an unborn. It's not that my parents uh, have anything against unborn. In fact, they respect them. Uh, it's just that they are fearful of me going to live in Britain. They're afraid of losing me in that sense, you know. Um, in spite of their vocal objections, I never punch. Um, Tom, this is the 21st century. You don't eat dog. That is uh, uh, old style of uh, solving a problem. Just ignore your parents. They wouldn't want to lose you, right? Definitely, you are the son. In the end, eventually, uh, they will have to accept Siva. But they went to temple, so um, what so called a medium and fortune teller. They are bent on breaking me and Siva out. But they are greedy for money. Although Siva is a nurse, they don't know that the father lives in 
bungalow in Orchard Road and the family lives very well. Although Siva is a nurse, I didn't tell them about this because I want them to accept Siva for what she is and not because of the family's wealth. Yes, very true. That should be the How is it? Hi. He's unconscious. But the dog is uh, uh, fighting hard to save his life. They say his chances are bleak. Oh. Massive heart attack. Oh no. He's so father. He can die. <laughs> don't worry, Hong. Don't worry. They are doing their best. And I'm very sure there's, a, uh, there's still a chance for him to pull through. Let's pray, Hong. Let's pray. Let's pray. <laughs>